pick up the sins. I gave him 20 bucks. He took all of it. All of it, All the trash is in Yeah, my left, one of the eyes broke back. I know he wore glasses. He doesn't. <laughs> Martisa called you in some pain pills. Okay, you can take those if you need them. But don't be surprised. A lot of people tell me that they just don't need them. They just take Tylenol. Okay. Okay. Um, you are going to feel. Um, a sense of discomfort more than you will actual pain, like sharp, ouchy, pinchy pain. Mm -hmm. Not so much. It's more like a, oh, this is just kind of sore and uncomfortable. Okay. Okay. I'm to go to sleep and wake up peacefully and safely under your protection today. And that you would always guide my hands and the hands of every doctor and nurse so that we may always be instruments of your healing. All of these things we ask in your son, Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Amen. All right, sweet dreams. And I'll see y'all in a little while. See y'all in a little while. be fun, all right? All right. Mm -hmm. What are you thinking, bro? Scared, man. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. You can put the part of the seat. She should be good. Yeah, she should be good. Are you ready to kick me in the no, I think it's a good idea for for people to know what the what the deal. It can it, it always helps young girls. Uh, you know, every everybody. She got di diagnosed with a with, with breast cancer in her left side, and uh, she caught it on time. She caught it at a perfect stage time, one. and it's stage one. And uh, just like the doctor told us, it's a little baby poodle that just came out, and uh, it's it's easy to manage, and hopefully everything will go. It's about a 90 to 93 percent, 95 percent. Chance. Chance of everything being perfect and stuff. So, feeling really good about it. Uh, she's gonna be fine. She's a strong woman. It's a crazy situation because she has it, and I also went through this, you know, some similar situation uh, last couple year, of, last year, a year and a half ago. Yeah. Prostate cancer, and that goes for you guys, man, because all the men have this stuff, and it's a very, uh, very important thing. You guys get checked and all that kind of thing. So. We all we we've been through it, and and uh, she's going through it right now. But she's a strong woman, man. She's so strong. She won't stay down. They tell her two weeks. Are you kidding? No, <laughs> three days. She'll be cooking her stuff like uh, in a few days. <laughs> she'll she'll be cooking some stuff pretty quick. Yeah. So, so we're, we're 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 pretty good. We're we're pretty. Uh, we're confident about everything going perfect. Yeah, it's, uh, it's still scary. I mean, yeah, it is. There's always that chance, you know. But it's uh, it's this week, like this past week, it's been like you know, kind of like I lost track of days a little bit. Yeah. It was getting closer to the day, and and it just kind of a little, yeah. little off. But trying to be positive about the whole thing. Yeah. Not sure we're worried. Yeah. And she's not too. She's worried. not worried at all. No, she's not. All right, Dad. all right, guys. I'm going to my car and hit it over there. All right. So, guys, I want you to know that. This has been going on for a while, and uh, you know we've been. The state's been approaching. Uh, it's April 21st, and we've known about this for a while. Just keeping you inside the family and everything. And if my mom didn't want this to be shown, like it wouldn't be shown. My mom is really, really excited to go through this and to kind of share everything with you guys, to share her experience, and hopefully be able to help a few people out or just kind of be a reminder, you know. Um, this is obviously very, very scary, and you guys saw the clips this morning, and it's surreal, but it's uh, something that, obviously today is like super, super crazy and terrifying and everything, but um, it's something that we're going to be able to learn from, so she's really, really excited to be able to talk to you guys about that, so in the next week or two, I'm sure she's going to be really pumped to talk to you guys, so we're going to record all this stuff, and uh, and Texas Bay Credit Union give me a chance to win. Mom loves to watch her novellas. And so she currently has this really old TV in her master bedroom where she's going to be staying for the next like week. And so I had an extra 65 inch in the guest room of the house. So we packed up the 65 inch and we're going to go swap out her TV before she gets home. So she can watch her novellas. The big 4K. <laughs> I'm going to swap out. Nala. I know, you're here. I'm here, you're here. <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> okay, so this is the TV we're swapping. The Hitachi. 
<laughs> so my mom, my mom's all drugged up right now. She has my dad and two of her sisters are here. So uh, needy. Bringing, so needy, man. Bringing her back. More needy than Ava. More needy than Ava. <laughs> bringing her back. And so I feel like she's all, she's on a bunch of drugs right now. She's gonna be so confused when she like clears her mind and sees a massive TV here. But this is where she sits to watch him. He's reclined. So she'll be here like all day. Wait, what do they use to um, put her under? Do they use like- I'm not sure. Man, is she gonna be like one of those viral videos? Man, well, they put it in, no, they put it in <laughs> when I was standing out and like uh -huh. literally as soon as she came back, she was like, she said, she goes, I'm feeling it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and then she went, so she's good. All right, let's hook up all of her cable boxes and stuff too. I got you a little gift. You yeah, it's in your room, so you can relax. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Big one. Okay. Did you get it? Huh? Did you go get it? Yes. Yeah, right. Good. Mm -hmm. Cheers. 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 They put that thing in your throat. They put that stuff on your so throat. Right. Air it comes out and it dries. Mm. See you later. Yeah, I'll see you soon. Yeah, you're going to uh, Yeah, I'll come back for dinner. I can't really eat much, but I'll come by. Well, we'll eat it for you. Right, well, <laughs> do something. I'm, maybe I'll bring you cake or something for dinner. Oh, or something. awesome. Some steaks. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Good. Okay, I'll see you in a little bit. Right. Hey, guys, it feels so good seeing my mom back, and she is. She didn't seem that out of it, but I'm sure she is really out of it. Not but. too bad. Yeah, not too bad. And uh, there were pretty much two options for her surgery. One was a smaller option, smaller, I guess less intense, um, because it was stage one and we caught it really early. Hopefully gonna get this out and that'll be the end of it. There's very, very high chances of that. I'm just being done with it. Um, option two was a much more intense surgery. I'm just pretty much taking all the breasts completely out. Um, but we didn't end up going that route. And that, that means that it definitely won't come back, right? It definitely won't come back. They were gonna remove all that and then like mm -hmm. cut stomach and like yeah. make breasts pretty much. And that's a very, very intense, high, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, long recovery. So she decided to go with the smaller surgery, um, which is recommended to her for her scenario. And yeah, uh, yeah you know guys, like it, it's crazy because she wants, she's gonna talk to you guys about this in more in depth and everything in the next week or two, but you never know what people or people and their families are going through. Um, you just never know. You know, I, I, my dad kind of touched on it a little bit earlier, but he went through prostate. He had prostate cancer, and uh, he went through 45 days of chemo, and that that was a very very tough time for our family. And that was just last year. Doing YouTube videos, putting a smile on, you know, and like you, you just never know. So always just be conscious of that. And uh, yeah, you never know the whole. You never know the whole picture. Nothing is always as perfect as it seems. So just treat people well and uh, keep that in mind. Now we're gonna go get some Javon some food because he hasn't eaten. Well, bro, you know what I haven't had in a while, man. What? <sighs> what? I haven't had a spicy chicken sandwich, man. You can't fit it. And a and a Chick Fil A cookie. I I might, maybe I'll, maybe I'll get one later, because I have a lot of macros. Like, I, I don't know if you can fit both of those. Oh, I right? thought you said that sounds gross. I was like... Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I got some Chick fil Milkshake? It's, it's <laughs> chocolate malt, man. <laughs> this is the uh, Diet Lemonade. I think it's like maybe 20 calories for this large, 25 calories. Nice. So good. I'm about, to, okay, so Russell painted this little this thing for us like a while ago. <laughs> But I'm about to ask him, how come the A, P, H, A, and the T have like the 3D shadowing, but then the L, the other L, and that, and the two E's are just like empty. I think that's his style, but I think he just forgot to put the shadowing on those. <laughs> For sure. You don't just put shadow in half the letters. Uh, if they don't have a pattern. There's no pattern. He definitely took an L on that one. Yeah. Was that a pun? That was a pun. Took an L. Took an L. I need you real quick. Real quick. Bro, I got a really serious question. Yeah, like, so, I saw that I'm pretty sure it would have been a bind or something like that. 
like that. Somebody had butter in the sock. It was like hitting it on my person. How come the L? Both L's and the last E don't have the three the, 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 the shadowing. Uh, there's no reason. I mean, like, that's kind of like an artistic decision right there. Um, I feel like the L's kind of stand out. And it's like, you know, people talk about L's in life, right? But I wanted to take the element out of the L because, like, not everything has to be an L. So I didn't complete the L. What about the E? What about the both E's at the end? I'm not gonna lie, I just messed up on the E, bro. One, two, three, four, five. And at the end, stretch again. One, two, three, then you're done. You can do that for three sets. If I can do 15, do 15 and do three five, sets? Five, five, yeah. five, yeah. If you can. All right, we're gonna keep this raw. Turn off the music, the weights. I got Brandon here. He's gonna take us through this workout. Giving him the reins today. He's gonna train. I'm ready. Right now, we're pretty much just warming up to get blood flow, right? That what you said? Yeah. This isn't really like, we're not really exercising yet, yeah. just kind of warming you're up. Gonna, you're, we're combining short reps with the stretch, so you get blood flow, but you also fucking contract the entire muscle because a lot of people only do the higher part of the lat, not the lower. This way you get both. Nice. It's awesome. <sighs> Down. This is super low. Okay, you should get the stretch to the Yep, right there. We're gonna live there. Okay. We'll do sets of 10. Alright. This is another warm up? No, this is the first exercise. Oh. Or even more. Almost 90. All the way. Now let your let your shoulders go forward. Pull. Down. Let it just stretch. There you go. Pull. Right there. That's it. You're gonna live there. You don't even have to go as heavy. How many reps? We're gonna do 10. Sets of 10. Four sets of ten here. It's gonna be the big, essentially the biggest lift for the whole workout. You, that's where you need to be. Let's yeah. try it. Okay. Yeah. No, don't try it, man. You can do it. I'm telling you. Yeah. This is where it has to be. Go. The underhand grip on an easy bar takes all the stress off your wrist. So if you have any kind of wrist problem, you're good to go. This yeah. is how you can row. Good. Down. There you go. Nice. You need at least eight. Come on, bro. Good. Come on. Come on. Three, come on, come on. Nice. So, yeah. So just to see, however, uh, uh, full stretch. I actually stand, it will give you, it makes it actually harder. These are just gonna be a solid movement. Okay. Then here, that's heavy, I don't know if I can do this. <laughs> uh, we're gonna stand in underhand. Yeah. And we're gonna pull here. Here, same exact fucking tempo, stretch. Here, stretch. Uh, right that's too heavy. Yeah, that, no, this is way too heavy. We're only 45 here. Yeah. Come on. Let's go, bro. It's all about the track. Nice. Check the form, guys. Good. One more. Get it. Ah. Yeah. Nice, man. Hey. Good. Hey. Two more. Now stretch, let it go, stretch, stretch, stretch. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Go left. Go right. Good. There you go. Just breathe. Come on. Seven. Six. Come on. Five. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Four. Come on. Three. Come on. Two. I got this one. There. Slow. Fuck yeah, there you go man. Stretch, 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 stretch. Nice. Stretch it. Stretch it, stretch, 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 stretch. So, t tell us what the benefit for the stretch at the end is? It's just static Ooh. stretching. It puts just more blood into the muscle. That's pretty much it. Okay. And yeah, it's, dude, it's great, literally. So you stretch, like you do a static stretch pretty much after every movement? And with back, it's mainly because a lot of people have a hard time contracting their back. Yeah. And so this way it keeps blood there instead of going to your biceps. Gotcha. So. Usually, a lot of people, myself included, after a certain amount of back training, like say three, four movements or so, you kind of stop feeling it. You, you feel like you're just rowing without actually engaging your muscles. Yeah. So it's just nice to like give yourself a it reminder. Gives, oh, hey, I'm gives, still working that. It gives a significant, it gives mind muscle connection. It, yeah. It's really in real life. There you go. You can't, when you stretch a muscle, you're going to feel it. And also at the end, we're going to stretch just preventative for injuries and stuff. We'll probably hang from the pull up bars, just sit there for like 20 second holds, and you'll still feel it. But you're going to be really sore. <laughs> right. Set, 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 more, more. Right there, pull. There you go. Pull. There you go. That's a freaking row right there. 
keep it right there. Yeah. Ah. No. What? Two more. Come on. Nice. One more. Biceps are crazy. Oh. It's been one hell of a day, man. One hell of a week. Ah, feels good. Just come in here. Let's go. Since they're already blown out, there's no need to go super heavy. And he's prepping. Literally, I literally can't go heavy. Yeah, he now. can get hurt. Yeah. No, when you're prepping, you don't need to. I mean, yes, you need to stay strong, but uh, that you get hurt like that. The, mu the muscle's already there. Exactly. Yeah, you don't. You're just focusing you're on. You're preserving. You're not yeah. building anything. And anyone yeah. tells you otherwise, they're lying to you. Unless it's year one, but you shouldn't be. Yeah, exactly. If you're new to training, there you go. Or you're obese. <laughs> you guys, notice how I'm su I'm literally. I'm not doing a curl like this. Supinating the wrist, twisting the pinky out. This is your bicep. If you notice, you twist, see how my bicep activates? So by staying in that position the entire time, we're completely supinated, completely flexed. Stays activated the whole, whole motion. entire time. Yeah, get the script away. Like that right there. Bring it down. Just like that. Come on. Nice. Abs looking good, bro. There you guys see Christian with the J. Oh, look at the J's. Yeah. Good weather without painkiller. You feel, feel real good? Yes. <laughs> With a painkiller. Uh, you know, you know when they, uh, do you remember when they pulled you out? Uh, they, so they, gave it, they gave it to you. Do you remember? And as soon as they rolled you, <laughs> you go, you, know, you go, I feel really good. Do you remember? <laughs> do you, do you remember I don't remember. Do you yeah. remember? I don't that. Yeah, they go, I feel really good. She said, when did they take me away? <laughs> wow. She said, when did they take me? I said, you don't remember? <laughs> I don't I remember going out, or yeah. coming in, nothing. Did yeah. No? She nothing. was not. Oh, wow. That's what she wants. That's, so yeah. That's what she wants? <laughs> so she just woke up, like, when he left, she just wow. woke up, like. Wow. Perfect. This is up to bunch. That's good, you're feeling good. Give me some uh, painkillers. And yeah. that took the pain. They, they go, yeah, you can take Tylenol if you want. <laughs> I'm like, nah. or, or you can take the, the, the real good one. stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, bigger. why? Why take Tylenol? Yeah. yeah. We're showing mom and dad the uh, the Caribbean Club. I already booked our trip to Grand Cayman again for 10 or 11 days in July. Mm -hmm. So I'm showing them like how clear the water is and stuff. Yeah. We've never been. You guys have never been to a beach like that. Yeah, like, like it's, that. This is the clearest ever. So mom's ready to go tanning. And, uh, yes. Mom tans and dad swims all day. Yes. But you don't tan? Oh, we, we don't have to. Like, oh, you mean you lay out? Like you lay I out. All, I, all I do is just walk. It just tans me right automatically. We're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna be darker than Christian Javon. and myself are like dark. Yeah. I'm gonna take lots of aloe vera because I I blister. Yeah. The first oh really? And see, uh, Javon's. Well, Chelsea's. They might go too on the same really? time because she's from maybe. There. So, yeah. Chelsea's from there. Yeah, you mm -hmm. told me this morning. Wow. Yeah. Maybe we can just get all together. And all That'd be fun, right? All right, just clear the back seat because I am completely out of groceries. This is only your second meal for the day, right? Yeah, but I'm already at like 900 calories or so. I had myself half of a protein bar, one of the little mini ones. So I only have like 12, 1300 calories left. So this will be the bulk of my calories today. And then what, some Halo Top for dinner? Or? Bro, I'm feeling a whole pint for dinner, man. Yeah. To be honest, the oatmeal cookie. If you guys haven't tried that one. I need to go get that. That I'm gonna try and it. vanilla bean, man. <laughs> Which one's better, would you say? Depends on your mood. They're equal? Equal. Yeah. It definitely depends on your mood. But I cooked up all the ground beef after the chicken. I've never had that much chicken like pre-made. And what I love about that chicken, it's the lemon pepper pre-seasoned one, mm -hmm. is that it's cut so thin. And Christian, you could cut your chicken really thin if you want. Yeah, I could, but that's just easy. They cook super quick. And uh, 
Yeah, I just made four tubs of it. Ooh, looks good. And I've got all this beef already pre-made. I'm gonna drain the fat, because that's what I recommend. And what are you eating? Just the sweet potatoes, or what? Not sure yet. All right, we're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flat, the plate's gonna be right here. Okay, you ready? Set. Look oh, man. man. 450 grams of sweet potato, 14 and a half ounces of chicken, one and a half servings of steamed broccoli. This is super bro, but honestly guys, I have been eating the same foods every single day. I don't have a problem doing that. I am a very easy guy. Um, I can literally eat chicken and sweet potatoes or beef and rice. I'm not hard to please when it comes to, you know, it's more of like just eat the thing in front of you and see the results for me. Um, obviously still tracking macros. Uh, current macros, 200 protein, 62, 63 grams of fat and right at about two, I range between 260 and 290 carb. I would say I average at 275, to be honest. Uh, so yeah, I'm also doing a lot of cardio. So I'm gonna season this stuff and enjoy this meal. Yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here. Um, I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and it turned into a really good day. Good day. We're gonna celebrate my dad's birthday uh, after a few more days when my mom can eat and sort of, um, you know, enjoy it with us. So thank y'all. I'll see you.